welcome again to aa home garden guys look at my goji berry seriously guys look at it it is branching out everywhere guys would have seen the video where when i purchased this to it was just like from probably about 40 centimeters a little tiny twig guys all of these here that's it just keep branching out all of these are new branches guys new branches everywhere it's just spreading and spreading and spreading and spreading you know these things are proper nutritious guys they're not the best tasting fruit mm -mm. not the best tasting berry at all these berries are not the nicest but i'm telling you because of the nutritional content it's worth incorporating in your smoothies and everything i can't believe guys it's in a tiny pot look there i think i have to repot it what do you think it's just in a tiny pot and it's branching in over there into my low cut, shooting up going to my grapes. Guys, I think I probably have to change the location as well. Because my Cape Gooseberry, which is here, when that starts spreading out and know that this is spreading, it's not gonna have space for both of them. Wow, wow. I take it around the other side so you can see how big this thing I've grown. You can see the branch about like going down to the ground guys come on man this thing i never know they grow so quickly but look there guys it's gone straight into my low quart which i cannot afford for anything to go in this space because i'm waiting for this thing to fruit okay so i have to move these i think i probably have to propagate some of it guys there's so much branches on here and the tree is roughly five feet now and it's because of where it is it's hard for me to show you in the totality but that's what it's like just branching out beautiful this have been evergreen all through winter it didn't shed its leaf guys so when most of the things are barren like my cape gooseberry this have the leaves on and it just continues spreading out all through winter so most of these growth you're seeing this is nothing to do with spring guys this has been growing like that since winter because i mean today is the 26th so you would roughly say spring i've just started well don't feel like i've started and it's freezing guys i'm gonna repot this i have a pot prepared here it's just some normal compost and while i repot the goji berry guys i'm gonna take cuttings okay because let's see if i can get this it should be and I have to change the location, guys. It's spreading everywhere. So, yes. Uh, did you hear that? Yeah, I'm coming to show you. So, the road. Uh, so, my little man is a cameraman today. Can you see the road that I just break? Probably you cannot even see. So, what happened, guys? Look at this thing. Wow, wow, wow. Uh, if you stand it right up, it's almost five feet there's a string on here i need to take off so there it is guys very very tall these things spread like crazy man look at it can you remember the video those were following me for ages can you remember the video of the good twig that i bought and then now i harvest one i harvest one of the the berry so this year guys look at they're spreading everywhere spreading everywhere I should be able to get loads and loads of berries this year. So let's see. I don't want to damage my fig there. I'm going to try and see if I can ease it out first. After I repot it, then I'm going to take loads of cotton, guys. And apparently the agent, in the agent community, they use the leaves as well. Wow. For soup and different, different things. So that's interesting. I probably have to go and research some more about using the leaves. But guys, I know this is a good berry to have. So let's see if we can i'm just looking to see like something like bloom ready to come out already but anyhow let's get it out guys let's get it out and see if i can without damaging i don't have a lot of i should have probably take it outside actually guys let's pause and take it out I have more space to maneuver everything pause no 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 no, no. excuse me so we're outside now guys more space to maneuver all these branches so what happened? I'm gonna tidy it up, I think. Tidy it. I'm gonna tidy it up and tie it up so I can get it into a uniform shape because it's like all over at the moment. So let's see 
Oh, that's the thing. The chickens are out already. And you know what the chickens are like. I need all this compass. No, 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 no. Ch -ch -ch -ch. Go somewhere else for the time being, Baba. No, no, no. Oh, I'm going to do this with you guys here. Hold on again. <clears throat> so I get a plastic bag to enter some of the compost. Ch -ch 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 -ch. Go the way. So. Oh, no, 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 no. Get away. So let's see if we can get this berry out. Scratch nothing, get away. Oh, you birdies. Oh, no, nah. I should have taken it out after I did my repotting. Now you're gonna scatter my dirt everywhere. Okay, so that's the root there folding up. See the bit that I break and I was putting in the other container. So let's take it, put it in the other one right here, and then. Try to get it to the same height it was in. You see? Oh, I'm trying to save that dirt. But the chicken is around. Oh boy, this chicken. So if I put it like that first, try and get back a stick in. I don't know, guys. Oh, this goji berry is getting everywhere. I have to try and then load back some dirt around it to balance it. So I do all of this. And then I get back to you. So here it is, guys. Back in the container now. So I'm going to get, get some sticks. String it up. And then start taking some cutting. To, so I can get loads more berries. But guys, you see the chickens. The chickens won't leave me alone. That's the thing. When I have repotting, it's best to keep them indoors. Until they finish your repotting. So I still have to come back fix this up and then guys this berry have grown so much and i have to keep it in pot guys because you know these things they're spread they're spread everywhere okay so if we put it all up it's like five feet tall okay so this one is oh no this one is broken is it oh it's like all twisted and tangled yeah, this is and everything so I have to come and fix them guys so much work springtime is so much work so i'm gonna get another stick and then i'm gonna tie it up guys all of these hopefully you can see all of these smooth these are all new goat guys if you see the older one it's kind of brownish so you can see that's the older stem so anywhere you see these total green that is totally smooth out like this guys in late winter all of these are new growth it just started springing up everywhere everywhere guys so i'm gonna continue with this now i'm gonna get another um steak put it here tie it up then i'm gonna feed it some stinky comfort and nettle tea and then i'm gonna show you how i'm doing the cuttings that's it now guys string it up everywhere holding it up tight Holding it up right now. So my little song gonna just water it in with some nettle and comfrey. And then afterwards, I'm just gonna find the best branches to tidy it up and just start my propagation. So yes, guys, look it I've grown. I'm so proud of my little goji berry plant. It was so tiny, guys. I'm gonna be in for a good harvest this year. That means I can make some lovely smoothie with these berries. So let it stay like that for a time being, babes. Soak that in and then to do some more, sir. So, yes, let's take some cutting now, guys. So I'm going to take some cuttings like this one. Overlapping, guys. So I'm just going to take this one off. You can see the little nodes on it. That's where the roots going to come from. So that's all I'm going to do, guys. I'm just going to take some cuttings like these. Then I'm basically, I probably just root it in the same pot as well. <laughs> I don't have anything prepared so you take a, a cutting like that ideally over six inches okay so take it like that i'm a little lad is gone so i have one hand so you take off take off the most of the leaves because i don't need the leaves these don't need no rooting hormones or anything i don't normally use rooting hormones anyhow if i do use i just use aloe vera or cinnamon okay so that's my rooting hormones so I just take this off. I'm just going to leave the top one. The top set of leaves. Just, just like that guys. 
so you can take off some more and then you just stick it in just like that and that will root so I'm just going, going around I'm gonna take off so that's one of the older cutting so you can see that's like more like a hardwood that's the older cutting the new cutting should root as well so like for instance let's take off a newer cutting and show you that it will root as well let's take off this one here okay and then I'm gonna go through and I'm gonna take off some more but I won't bore you with all of that so you do the same thing you just take off the leaves guys I know goji berry is not the nicest tasting berry I definitely know that but sometimes our food is not about taste guys is the nutritional content of it and if you include this in berries you can mask the taste you don't have to eat it fresh you can heat it with your sea um, porridge or you can sprinkle it on your porridge or whatever and you would taste it that way or if you eat cereal you put it on your cereal but if you don't like the taste of it just incorporate it in smoothie guys and you won't taste it as much but you're getting all nutritional value and then that's it so i go through and do the rest of it but but for my lovely goji berry plant that's looking a bit wilt now from the sun is warm and i just repot it so i'm going to put it somewhere cool so i can just revive so for my beautiful 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 goji berry to your garden i see you on the next upload take care now bye bye like share subscribe and click the notification bell